imager brain. It's I I, really, I picked up on this from like some of the newer video games. Like I grew up on like you know like Super Nintendos and shit, and like N64 wasn't even that bad. But like when it gets into these new ones with like uh, the new Call of Duties and stuff, some of the engines and the lighting systems. It made me fucking not like I could play for 10 or 15 minutes, but then there's other games that use different engines and I can just play forever like Grand Theft Auto 5 or Warcraft or something for some reason the engines don't and I just wanted to look at this how uh, This video is about how how do 3d models like exhaust and damage our brain or your brain <laughs> Your brains! So, how does 3D technology work? Modern 3D effects in movies, TV, and video games are optical illusions. Two forms of visual media are broadcasted concurrently so that 3D glasses can assist your eyes and brain to interpret the content. Your right eye sees one version of the content, while the left eye sees another. The brain then merges those images together into a 3D image. Whew. Even if you have one eye. Like, it, like an ogre. Like a... Like a... Uh, is 3D bad for your eyes? That's what we're talking about. Is this stuff bad? What is this? Uh, with the, the potential for 3D content to overwhelm and confuse the brain, there are concerns that 3D can damage your eyes, especially for those with vision problems. Maybe that's why I, I, my fucking eyes are already fucked up. I don't need to fuck me up more. It's hard to avoid 